This is a story from Be My Eyes. Hello, my name is Victoria. I just turned 46. I was born in Argentina and I've lived in four countries. Everything started when I was 26. I had my very first episode of optic neuritis, which is inflammation of the optic nerve. And eventually we found that it is neuromyelitis optica, which is also called Devix's disease. I've been blind now for maybe like, I think it's been like a year and eight months, but never from moment one, I never took it as a bad thing. I'm driving through life in a different lane. I've taken this experience to learn. Oh my God, what a master's degree on what's important in life. What a master's degree of perspective. Now I celebrate the fact that I can find number two on my elevator where the gym is. Six months ago, I decided to try to go to the gym on my building. I live on the 11th floor. and The gym is on number two. I went to the gym touching the walls. When I got to the gym, I had to touch the machines to remember where the treadmill was. For two weeks, I did that with tears coming. Sorry. Tears rolling down my eyes. I was able to turn on the treadmill. I felt so proud of me. I said, nothing's going to stop me. It's been hard taking away the independence. That's one of the many things that is very, very difficult. And it, I continue to be open, to be taught lessons, to be taught how strong I am, I never knew. Most limitations are in the mind. I say most because if you say, Victoria, drive a car now, of course I couldn't. But most limitations are only in the mind. I have been using be my eyes for, I would say, three to four months. And my experience has been unbelievable. And what I have seen is people want to be called, all the volunteers. Be my eyes has improved my life so much. You would not believe what I do now with Be My Eyes. Because I used to be a declutter queen. I used to love to organize, but I always have to ask for help. I've done like eight cabinets with my eyes. But what I do is I select, let's say, maximum five items. That would be five items at a time per volunteer. So I don't take too much of their time. And also, that way I can give somebody else the opportunity to give, which is so and so enriching. They say that you have more happiness when you're making somebody else happy. Sometimes I call a scene in the morning and I get somebody in Australia and we talk about rugby. Also, it's fantastic. I love it. It has given me so much more independence, less asking of favors. And now I know that somebody that is happy on the other, on the other end, happy to get my call. This was a story from Be My Eyes. If you liked it, Please share and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more great ways to use Be My Eyes.